Welcome back, folks, one and all, to Let's Play Sam and Max Hit the Road. When we last left off, we got ourselves a world of fish magnet. Uh, no, that, that that's apparently not a way we can go. No, it is! You just got to walk. Music's gonna be... Oh, the Tunnel of Love! It doesn't look very love-inducing, does it? Tunnel of Love. Hmm. Uh, that's a pretty sad swan. I think this is the proverbial ugly swan that used to be a beautiful duckling. Oh. Oh well, time to use it. Wanna ride the Tunnel of Love? Uh-oh. Yippee! Max is so easily amused. By the way, if you're wondering what the introduction has to do with the game, you've not seen Sam and Max enough. Ooh. Better to reign in hell than to serve in heaven. Milton. Heaven is a place where nothing ever happens. David Byrne. Huh? This is an odd tunnel of love. Wow, a loving recreation of that Evelyn Morrison classic, Revenge of the Gill Guy. You really should get out more, Sam. Yeah. You should. Bats. Just another random acts of violence. Ah. Uh. Thank goodness today's leaders react more calmly to negative opinion polls. Yeah, they probably did. This is the worst tunnel of love ever, and I've been on no tunnels of love in my lifetime. I can tell you, this one is the worst. Hands down. That was... Pretty sad. Well, that was fun. My little body's covered with swan pimples. Hmm. I think we're missing some. We missed something there. Oh no, no, we didn't miss anything. We just didn't use the item we needed to, which was the torch. Want to ride the tunnel of love again? Why not? Because it's terrible! I'm surprised this place is in business. Okay, this time... We will use the torch. Oh. Come on. On the walls! Ah! Max on the fuse box. That's probably a good idea. That's probably that's probably a good idea. I should have tried it sooner. Uh oh. Well, it looks like we're running a tunnel of love again. I suppose the tunnel of love act it stop. I suppose the fuse box stops us from doing anything. There's a big clue in this jaggediness of the uh, lightning thingies. This time I know what to do. Surprised that the swan's still doing anything. That ride continues to amuse me. No, it doesn't. I think we're supposed to do something in there, Sam. Yes, we are. We're going to do something in there. Don't worry. Let's ride the TOL again. TOL. If you insist. If you insist. Oh, you're not enjoying it anymore, Max. But you love the TOL. You love it. a good idea. Maybe I should try... Hmm. Ah, uh, here we go. Here we go. We got it. We got it. Come on. There you go, little buddy. <laughs> well, that worked. 
Hooray! Now we're messing around with everything. Because we are terrible. Come here, Max. What's up? Check this out. What are we doing? I'll never shave again. You never did. <laughs> well, there's a secret door. I didn't actually know that would be there, so let's go into the secret door. Oh, we have found a house. Well, this is interesting. Don't flick it. This looks like the Tunnel of Love reset switch. Hello. Just like at the bowling alley. Don't press it. Count just spud us in his native habitat. Well, let's talk to him, I guess. Hello. Who are you? Exactly. I'm, I'm Doug, the Mole Man. Who are you? I'm Sam. He's Max. We fight crime. We try to. And we like long walks along the beach. We do. What do you want from me? Uh, money. Do you know anything about Bruno the Sasquatch? Yeah. Bruno the Sasquatch? Why, the stories I could tell you. Stop him, Sam. He's going to tell us a story. Yeah, stop him. I first met Bruno 25 uh, years ago in Saigon. Oh, God. Several hours later. Uh. And then there was the time we all had our taxes done by a platypus. Uh. Shut up. For God's sake, just shut up. Look, we just want to know where Bruno is now. Gee, I have no idea where he went. Maybe you should talk to my uncle. Your uncle? Yeah, my uncle Shavul. He's really into Bigfoots. Huh? When I was a kid, he used to no! tell me stories about giant Bigfoot no! parties, where all the Bigfoots of the world would get together and dance Bigfoot dances. No. And... That's great, kid. Where can we find your uncle? Mm. I don't know. He disappeared a short time after he helped build the largest ball of twine on Earth. Oh. Well, there's the largest ball of twine on Earth. I think I may weep openly. Probably. Look, you two seem trustworthy. Yep. Oh, we are. Yes, you can trust us as far as we can throw you. Which is quite far. So if you bring me some pecan-flavored candy, I'll give you my key to Trixie's trailer. Ooh. I'll also tell you a big secret about how Bruno escaped. Why not tell us now? Yeah. Because I'm hungry. That's a good reason. There you go. Here, I thought you might like some candy. Pecan flavored candy. Thanks. Pecan's my favorite. Yep. Hey, you're all right. Take this key as a token of my appreciation. Standard quest completion. Oh, it's, it's... That's a... That's a crowbar. Wow, this is some key. Okay, Sam, let's get the hell out of here. Ah. Wait. I've got a great story you should hear. Oh. <laughs> Keep it short, kid. My partner's got a low tolerance for long stories. Very low. Well, it all started the day before today. I remember it like it was yesterday. That's because it was. Okay. It's not widely known, but Trixie had fallen in love with Bruno. Oh. Every night, she'd sneak into the freak show tent and read to him what she imagined to be his favorite bedtime story. We'd ask you know if they were, mind you. She seemed as happy as a self-mutilated parody of nature could be. We don't know if he was, though. But she could never truly be happy until her beloved Bruno was free. Aww. A cake! Finally, she decided to do something about Bruno's predicament. She begged Flambe, the fire breather, to free the Bigfoot from his icy cage. Flambe took pity on poor Trixie and liberated Bruno. Oh. And the happy couple haven't been seen since. Okay. Tell the story, ain't it? Yes. I don't believe it, but... Okay, let's leave. I'm done with this tunnel of Louvre. Uh, how do we how do we leave? How do we leave? I suppose we 
Chip. I think somebody needs to flip a switch before this thing starts again. Ah, uh, yes, I know which switch I'm referring to. We need to flip this switch. There. That should get things running again. Let's get out of here. Up and away. We did something! Woo! Achievement! So until next time, folks. Until then, when we'll break into Trixie's locker and then... Locker? Trailer. And then try and find the happy couple and break them up. Because we have to. Because we're Sam and Max! Until then, folks. Until then. I'll catch you later. See you then.